Hey guys, my name is Jack, aka Money With Guns, and I'm a little sad right now. Um, I will talk about that momentarily. As you can see, we've made progress. Progress you haven't seen. We're gonna be playing as the robot today um, by recommendation. Unfortunately, it's not the first time I played as the robot, but we will talk about that. Essentially, I recorded a full video. It was like an hour, over an hour long. And um, totally like got done with it afterwards, went to check it and it said that I can't play it because the audio file is not, sub or the, the file type is not supported. No idea why. Literally, I tried a hundred different things to fix it. The video is just iced. It's a particularly big bummer because um, we did make some progress. It was the first time I played as the robot, which is cool. And um, I'm in the middle, or I'm beginning a gauntlet of recording again, where I have to record just a ton of videos. All right, this guy basically has to die, unfortunately. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm bummed, but hopefully this video will get recorded. If it doesn't, then we might be looking at a slight downwards tick in the amount of videos. So, what's the deal with the robot? Um, basically, as you can see, um, power sap, I'll talk about that more in a second. Um, rechargeable, your melee firearms and speed attributes start very high and get lower along with your battery, so your stats go down over time. Um... Don't get affected by status effects. Explosions don't harm you, and um, explosions destroy any wall or object. So um, you can see we have a timer. Charge level four. You want to be a charge level four. You press left trigger. It's um, it's any power source and gives you energy. That's how you heal. That's how if you go down to charge level one, you begin to take damage. It's like the investment banker in a lot of ways. Um, and your big quest is to turn all of those things off. And basically every time so far, I've been caught by the police trying to do that. I'm also going to occasionally have to just make sure my camera isn't pausing because I also had a problem with that in the last video. Um, it's unfortunate, but uh, yeah, I, I wouldn't be as bummed about it if I didn't have to record like probably like seven more videos. Um, moving moving forward is, is probably what I'll be ended up or what I'll end up having to do. Um, I'd like to come in. Hello, sir must be neutralized i'm going to have to take the energy from something i don't think i can sap any of this stuff can i get the fire hydrant nope okay we'll have to just hit this thing right here and then we'll be back up to level four we'll be well on our way to success it does trigger that thing as soon as i interact with it they're gonna hate that don't really care this one's all about making enemies right as that's how i see it so far um, you can basically, it basically triggers any electronic device that you interact with. So right there, please don't like that, but it instantly turns off all the power around me. I can use it to free slaves, but the slave masters will be very upset about that. Um, people hear it. It also does like an AOE effect where it will confuse people and do damage. So, um, the ability is extremely good, keeps us healthy, all that kind of stuff, but it does cause a lot of problems. So, um, I think the, um... I was recommended to play this character by somebody in the comment section, which I very much appreciate. They, uh, I didn't really want that. We don't get many followers. It's not the biggest mistake in the world, but it's a bit of a bummer. Um, they said it's, it's a good, it's one of the easier characters. Once you get a hang of it, it's not necessarily like easy off the bat, but once you understand like the, the gameplay like loop, you can kind of, uh, really, really pop off. And they also said it's a good speed run character. So I think it, uh, it'll end up working out if I really learn. I mean, um, if I learn how to make it work for myself. Countdown is started. We can't use to press buttons, which is unfortunate. Um, yeah, you're not gonna like this. Sorry, buddy. If you try to stab me, I will just run away from you. You are like an ant to me. Yeah, so I'm kind of... Unfortunately, I'm, I'm gonna be in a bit of a hurry. So if we lose early here, I basically have to... Now that I've wasted a ton of my time... I'm gonna cut back here and get this thing. Wasted a ton of time today. Um, I basically have to record like seven videos as soon as I can. I'm not like on a time limit, but it is kind of late at night. Just gonna see how many cops I can make angry in one single move. Um, yeah, so so not objectively in a hurry or anything, but I would like to sleep tonight is kind of the, the way it's at. I would have had more time because I think if you... Technically, the beginning of the recording gauntlet was the last 1010 video, which is where I realized that I was going to have to record a bunch of videos before I uh, go out of town for the weekend. 
in the Temtem video, I said it's 3.30. Now, it is not. It is probably like 10 or something like that. And there is a very specific reason why it is that late. Essentially, um, I, well, okay, so after that, I didn't, I, I took a little bit of a break. I've been obsessed with Fantasy High, if you guys know what that is. It's a very bingeable show. So I spent a little bit of time watching that, not that much. Um, and then I started um, downloading VODs from Twitch and uploading them. So those videos will be going up over the next couple days. And well, one's probably already gone up. Um, so that took a little bit of time. And then I decided to go get something to eat, which was apparently a mistake. Where, not not really, but the, basically, I went down to this local restaurant. My, my mom was hanging out there. She was there with um, some random people. She, she'll just go to bars and just start talking to like random people, make friends with them, all that kind of stuff. And uh, they didn't even know that I was here. It's not dangerous. Um, yeah, so she, um, I went down there, talked to her, and ordered something to go. I was just hanging out outside, standing away, like on the patio and that kind of thing and i thought i would have all of them by now okay um it's the last one yeah caused a lot of problems and yeah so i ordered a turkey burger and just chilled 45 minutes later burger was not there i was displeased i'm not one to like yell at the waitress because i've been a waiter before um i just understand the service industry in general but I still, I went in and I'm like, hey, I've just been waiting for a minute. You guys know what's up with that. She, the, the server is a family friend too. So um, she was like, yeah, yeah, I, I put in the order. It just hasn't come out yet. And I'm like, okay, understandable. And um, I was cool to hang out. Hour and 15 minutes after that, two hours total, burger. I'm still not there. I go in, ask what's up. They're like, oh, uh, sorry, we it'll be out in a moment. And then like 10 minutes later, I came out. And um, <clears throat> honestly, I was not that mad. Wasted a little bit of my time, but I, I was hanging out, talking to some people, having a little bit of fun. You know, it, it wasn't horrible. It wasn't a total waste of time. Um, but then I was getting ready to walk home. And basically, if you know me, wherever, whenever I walk anywhere, I always have to have my headphones in. It's just always playing music. So I balanced the, like the styrofoam box with the food in it on the railing next to me and got my headphones out and began to put those in and, uh, most unfortunate gust of wind came into play and the um the turkey burger was on the way down i it was like balancing kind of like teetering down and i realized that it was essentially it, it was essentially a lost cause <clears throat> but i still went for it anyways and i just tried to grab it as, as quickly as i possibly could and instead i just ended up smacking the burger into the air and just absolutely launching it all over the patio. Everybody thought it was very funny. I thought it was very, very um, unfortunate, painful, embarrassing, shameful, all of the above. And the burger had been lost two hours and I didn't even get food out of it. So that was another reason why I wasted some time. And then I got back here and sulked, watched more Fantasy High, and uh, then I recorded an hour long video spent uh, 30 minutes afterwards trying to figure out why it wasn't uploading and then yeah now I realized I'm just forced to record a brand new video and it's, it's not the worst thing in the world but you know it's a bummer it's a bummer um, I probably could be playing better right now but playing a little bit of a fast and loose just cuz uh, I'm in a hurry not in a hurry you know but again I would love to not be up until 4 in the morning because that does have an effect on the content. This character is immune to the poison because it is like a, or the ooze, because it is like a poison effect. So I can walk on it as much as I want. Hello, cop. You still mad at me? Or are you just jealous? You're just jealous. Okay. I very much struggle finding these freaking power sources. We got the one, we just need one more. Yeah, I don't know if you guys have seen Fantasy High, but if you're into d, &D content, um, Dungeons and Dragons, of course, I would highly recommend it if you're like a critical role fan i think it's a very very interesting take on the on the concept where essentially it's it's like it's fantasy it's it's a lot like onward it came out two years um before on your onward released but it is the, the dnd world but in a um dude where the heck is this thing um but it's surrounded by or but the main characters are high school kids trying to like explore their lives and um solve mysteries and and crimes all while dealing with their their fantasy related life through there is not another power source it would have appeared on my map by now like for real what the heck this is annoying 
Um, it's a lot of fun. It's from the College Humor guys, so um, you, can, you can count on them to really like provide some entertaining content. They, it's always good with like the D and D stuff, um, like live content when the people are like versed in like improv and just like acting and, and comedy in general. Do, is it? Please don't even tell me it's up by the, the thing. The escape here. Jeez, I'm very disappointed in myself. Later, nerds. Just wasted all of my time, but um. Yeah, it, it's, it's definitely a lot of fun. The people are really cool. You've probably just seen them before on random internet videos if you um, aren't exactly sure who College Humor are. They appear in a lot of stuff. Um, <clears throat> the one guy, um, I don't know his real name, but he plays Fabian Seacaster in the... Uh, would you like to just leave? Yeah, of course not. Um, he plays Fabian Seacaster in uh, Fantasy High. He's going to be in the new um, Pete Davidson movie. I guess it's about Pete Davidson's life, kind of. Which, personally, doesn't interest me that much. But, honestly, just to see this guy act in, like, a big movie, I'd be kind of interested in that. Because he's he's definitely, he's a he's a really good character in that show. Really entertaining guy in general. Uh, didn't College Humor, like, close down? Maybe, maybe they're just, like, old College Humor friends. Well, I thought I heard something. I don't know if this is like an official College Humor thing, essentially. Um, but uh, yeah, I thought College Humor like closed or like, like they got bought up by some big organization, Smosh style, maybe. Some something weird going on like that. Keep it stealthy. Decent play. Make a little bit of noise there, but I should be able to get out of this. Oh no. I was playing well there, but. I forgot that there was an entire other thing that I had to dodge. Hit that. Okay. They didn't get confused. I was hoping they would get confused. We need to get two of the uh, power sources, and then we can kind of bounce here. Yeah, I do. Real quick. Um, Alt-Tab. Make sure. Oh. Not, not like this. Not like this. Sorry. They freaking... I accidentally selected the wrong tab after I... Alt-Tab. I know that's going to make some enemies. I'm not too worried about it, though. I'm just trying to find the other one so I can go ahead and bounce. Oh, I did see it down here. And just teleport. Hit that. And kind of just bounce. It's a very The robot's very tanky. He has a lot of health. Um, doesn't seem to take that much knockback. I was trying to get a little bit of HP. And, yeah, you just have, like, essentially... Endless HP as long as there are electronics still on the floor. It's a really good character. Definitely understand why it's a speedrunner. Um, gives you a lot of like easy outs. Um, hmm. Yeah, critically it seems good. Like if you have to blow up one of the generators, you can just like EMP it through the wall and it'll blow up in 10 seconds. Man. The goal is to keep myself together throughout this recording spree. I don't, I don't want it to be noticeable that I've been recording for like 10 hours straight. Oh. Um, let's just, let's just, let's nuke it. Alright. That's been dealt with. We can go up here. Maybe just trade this lady an item. How did they know it was me? I don't love that. Not sure how they would know it was me. Would you like money? Okay. Anything to get me out of this, this horrible situation I put myself in. Why not? Get some extra HP. They're already hitting anyways. <clears throat> neutralize. Neutralize. Okay, this one may not be that bad if I can time... Oh, looks like he's probably just going to neutralize himself, honestly. Yeah. You'll love to see that. Okay. We need one more of... There it is. Okay. Gentlemen. Don't mind me. Keep him moving. I definitely understand why it's a speedrun character. Especially if you, like, weren't even... Ooh, I have that. The fire hydrant out. Or fire extinguisher. Especially if you aren't, like, going for your big quest. Like, there is just nothing holding you back just from totally running through with this one. Especially just with the consistent HP, healing, all that kind of stuff. And we'll go ahead and go down. This is... Okay, come on. Sorry, I have to resync this up. There we go. Um, 
Yeah, let's go Blockbreaker. I kind of feel like this guy throws a lot of punches, typically, or at least with melee weapons. Um, when you're on level four, you, you really hit pretty hard. Okay. Bombs are dropping. Okay. Unfortunately, if we activated that, it would destroy him. I wish that wasn't neutralized, but... Okay. Give this guy a free way out. Hopefully, sneak past. Oh, you love to see that. That was just perfect. Okay. Watch your step. If you explode after that perfect play, then I will... Dude, 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 dude. Okay. Didn't love that, but... That was a pretty efficient way to handle that. I'll go ahead and... Pulse there, don't care if this cop hates me. All the cops hate me. Pretty much all the time is the robot. Free health is always appreciated. All right. Let's go ahead and go in here. Gotta get these buttons. Yeah. Unfortunately, just because, like... Dude, I'm, I'm mad. Like, I was good, and then, of course, he just... The bomb had to lay him right on, on me and force him to look at me, but... Um, unfortunately, I don't think I'm gonna be able to record any um i was gonna do some winging it episodes for the weekend too but i think just since now i have to record so many videos in such a short period of time i don't think i'll be able to get any of those out over the weekend but as soon as i get back we're gonna have plenty of those just with all the games that i played or i got from the uh the bundle because that bundle is just absolutely nuts if you don't don't know what i'm talking about it's itch dio itch.io's bundle for justice and equality or something racial justice and equality maybe um Essentially, uh, freaking just an absurd amount of developers got together and um, contributed their game, th their game to this bundle. It's a pay what you want, um, anywhere up or anywhere above five dollars, and you get access to. Last I checked, it was literally fifteen hundred games. So, it's like literally, I I don't even know why you would ever pass up this deal. It like helps good people. I mean, I guess if you don't think it's, they're good people, which you know. Um, it's a different argument altogether, but in my opinion is an extremely worthwhile charity and um, Still don't have this other thing found yet And you get just a ton of games out of it. It's an it's an absurdly good deal There we go we Make some enemies, but luckily they were a little distracted there for a second and we'll be able to run um, Yeah, I mean like even if you don't have like a computer now that can handle the games like literally i would still do it because you can make a login to itch.io and you can literally download it anywhere so as long as you remember your login information you can access these games anytime um it's it's just insanely worthwhile and it all it just gives you a chance all to bring people's attention to to donating to this cause and helping people so you love to see the gaming community so do something awesome like this okay like like i said this is a, these these runs can really pop off or like even, I guess the comment said, um, it's pretty, pretty nuts real fast. Okay. I would really like this guy just to leave me alone. What do we got to do in here? Retrieve the item. That'll get somebody's attention. Is he shooting at me? Okay. Poison water. Uh, yeah, that's one thing. The robot cannot go in water without taking damage, so might as well poison it. They get it hurt everybody sneak past okay well that was just a, a bad play there all right um we got regen health all right i'm actually gonna use my we can't eat food anyway so it doesn't really matter um let's throw this on the rocket launcher silence the rocket launcher it's just an incredible concept and then we'll add some dur dur durability to this thing i'm already slurring words and we're not even one full video in it's gonna be a long night i'm personal officer it's merely my one task as a robot you you have to understand okay you guys are gonna hate this not as much as i'm gonna enjoy it though the cannibals are just so frustrating, especially when you get the war zone floors. They're just, they're, they're nuts. I never pass up an opportunity to stick it to those guys. All right. Probably could have saved that one to last, but it honestly doesn't matter. We're kind of just, just popping out of control right now. All I got to do is find this last thing and we can be out of here. Excuse me, ghosts. 
Yep. So I think I have to record two Streets of Rogue episodes, two Dicey Dungeons, two Temtem. That should be it. Maybe one more than that. Not entirely sure. I just can't like believe that sometimes I go like the entire floor without at least seeing the other thing. I guess this is kind of just in the middle of nowhere, but it just seems impossible. All right, I'm forcing other people to fight, which is also nice. At least gets their their distraction away from me. Don't have their aggro. Okay. Sorry, officer. You're not gonna give me this time. Sap damage. Makes the, the damage more powerful. Very good. Pretty much always take those yellow ones. I like the things that kind of augment the character specifically. Um, lets you access some perks that you normally can't really do. Hate the dudes who just hide in the bushes. You're the worst. Alright. Back off. Maybe I can... Well, no, they're... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna go for it. No, we can, we can wait here. Maybe we can time this decently as well. Maybe one of them will happen to come back. We have to retrieve this item. Nice. Nah, it's not going to work. We'll at least get their attention, but... Okay. Let's go after this guy first. Just, just textbook. You'll love that. Okay, and then immediately followed by comeuppance and fool foolishness. I got a full hat basically impossible to do that out of harm's way in my opinion i did it a few times but i gotta rescue dang it it's always the guys who are the easiest to kill that need to be rescued um hmm. let's go just run just run they can't catch you they don't have guns worst soldiers ever less armed than our police too political you should be good to just bounce. Watch the... Okay, I guess I'll, I'll hold your hand all the way down. Uh, camera's still good. Sorry about that. I'm not, Yeah, currently, if you don't know, I'm using my phone as the recording um, webcam setup, which is just terrible because every time my phone, if it drops below, or if it hits the thing where it says, like, low battery 20%, then the recording on the camera just stops. Can't turn that off. I have it plugged in, but even that, like... I have a messed up charger, so if I move like an inch the wrong, or like if I accidentally shake the table too hard, it'll potentially like unplug the charger in a way that's not noticeable, and I won't even like know. So I gotta check occasionally just so the recording doesn't get caught up and just be kind of a bummer if halfway through the video my webcam started pausing. It just, it would just end up being frustrating because it would cover a portion of the screen and there would just be nothing, and I can't really just edit it out afterwards, I don't think. Man. I'm just thinking of all the words that I'm going to be saying in the next, like, however long time is, is truly daunting. I was talking to one of my friends the other day, and he told me that he was going to start Twitch streaming. And I'm like, dude, go for it. It's really easy, especially if you have PS4. It is very easy. The quality is on, like, not necessarily, like, great, but nonetheless, like, just the, um, the fact that you can, like, attach your Twitch to it or like yeah link up your twitch to it without doing anything besides typing in the password and then straight up stream from that is is super awesome and uh very useful why is it so hard to get out of there um but he told me that he, he told me my streams weren't long enough and i'm like i don't know i don't like like really long streams like i think my longest was four hours and a lot of them have just been like an hour long and it's like it's not that big i mean if you want to hang out just come hang out if not I'll be streaming, like, I've streamed relatively regularly. Won't be able to over the weekend, unfortunately, but, um, I've been, I've been pretty good about it, but, uh, he told me that his first stream was gonna be 18 hours, which made me laugh a great deal. He will, he, he will not. He, he just couldn't possibly do that. Nothing personal against him, he just, he thinks it's, like, way easier than it is, and is... He just thinks it's way easier than it is. What can I say? See how easy this is? All right. I, I didn't even notice my ult was low. I was being lazy. I was not focused. Um, we'll probably come back, try to do another robot run after this, 
and we'll see how that goes. Normally I would record, I would probably go for another run on this video because we're a little short, but um, just because I have to record so many videos. Hope you guys understand. Thank you for the support. I've been getting a lot of comments recently, people interacting. I appreciate it. Check out the Twitch stream. Um, go ahead and follow, put on notifications in case you want to be notified when I'm going live. Um, and then check out that awesome bundle. I think it probably um, closes in like a three or four days. So if you if you want a bunch of awesome games, it's, it's totally worth it. And um, other than that, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next six videos I'm going to be recording. Later.